She's best known as Superwoman to her fans. In the last six years, Lily Singh has amassed over 7 million subscribers and more than a billion views on her YouTube channel. Now she's capping off her world tour with the film A Trip to Unicorn Island. It's exclusively available on YouTube Red starting February 10th. And we want to talk about this. Lily's here at Post 9. Thanks for joining Thanks us. Thanks for having me. Um, people are, are kind of excited about this YouTube Red thing. Mm -hmm. um, the parent company, Alphabet, had these earnings the other day. And all the analysts were so excited about the potential of YouTube. Yeah. Um, they felt like we're really just at the beginning of what's possible here. Do you feel like that with I, YouTube? I sure hope so. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I'm very confident in YouTube Red. I'm very loyal to YouTube. I have a great partnership with them. Um, um, I think they have great things coming forward. For what sure. kinds of things? I mean, so the, t tell us about this film yeah. and like the kinds of video clips you're already posting. Are they short? Are they long? Well, I mean, regular YouTube still exists. So if you want to watch YouTube for free, you can. Every Monday and Thursday, my regular videos are still there. YouTube Red is a different way to watch YouTube. It's ads free. You can watch videos offline and you get premium content such as my film, A Trip to Unicorn Island. Cool. Yeah. You know, there's this general sense that everything's blurring together. So whatever, 15 years ago, if you wanted to have the same sort of career, you're going through these standard mm -hmm. sort of media channels right now. Um, did it happen for you kind of by accident, by doing regular YouTube, as you put it, and it just sort of built up to this point? Or did you survey all the options and say, this is the way I'm going to go? Oh, I surveyed no options, to be <laughs> honest. I was in my last year of university, a very confused student, didn't know what I wanted to do. I was pursuing an undergrad in psychology, which my heart rose really in, and uh, I discovered YouTube around the same time and I thought okay let me post a video I did it and I fell in love with the challenges associated with getting people to watch my content online and but it just kind of when it was time to make a movie though did you say oh now I can take this to Netflix or oh now maybe I can HBO or something or was it just YouTube and only YouTube well no I definitely had options I mean I had this great tour it was a great experience I wanted to share it with my fans in a way that a lot of my fans could consume it and I thought the way that makes the most sense is to use the platform they're most comfortable with already and not try to drive them to another platform. Something, right, yeah. Who, who are your fans? What, who is your, I, I've not experienced. I hope you. <laughs> I, I, I haven't experienced the superwoman experience yet. <laughs> yet. 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 Well, I mean, um, but, uh, but, so who, who is the, your average fan okay, if there is such so, a thing? So uh, I would like to thank the world, but no, my main demographic is 15 to 25 female is my main demographic. But I mean, when I was doing shows around the world, there was such a variety of people. I mean, I did the Today Show earlier and there was 200 people outside wow all ages and just male and female and it was great to see that's so cool. maybe you can get 200 people uh back in here <laughs> yeah i'm already <laughs> met some, some people. alphabet stuff right. <laughs> i know they're excited to see you lily thanks for coming down thank you so much best of Appreciate luck with it. it as well thank you lily Singh. hey youtube fans i'm landon downey from cnbc thanks so much for checking out our channel here you'll find videos packed with all the info that you need to be smarter about your finances be sure and subscribe by clicking right here and click on all the videos around me to see CNBC's original series, Young Money, Tech Bet, Kramer's Mad Money, and all the latest from CNBC.